Hi guys, welcome back to the CajunCrawfish.com kitchen today. Uh, what we're featuring today is our farm-raised Texas redfish. We actually bring the fish in whole, break it down, uh, get it seasoned up and ready for you to eat. This one here has uh, kind of our proprietary Cajun spices. Uh, it's going to come in frozen. We actually have it here what we call on the half shell. So the skin's still on it. It still has the scales. Perfect item for your summer barbecue. Um, or, or what we're going to do today, we're just going to throw it in the oven. Uh, again, this comes in pre-seasoned. It's going to be frozen. You want to let it stack out in your refrigerator for a day or two. And it is ready to cook. All I'm going to do today is open the package. I've got a, uh, a foil lined baking sheet. I'm going to spray it with a little pan. And we're going to get this in the oven. So I've got my oven preheated about 400 degrees. Again, completely seasoned, ready to go. I'm going to cut the package open. We'll kind of pull it, pull it right out. And again, as you can see, it's got the got the skin still on it and the scales. We call this on the redfish on the half shell. Um, ready to go, Cajun spices. We'll just take it, we'll throw it right in the oven. We're gonna let it go for about two minutes. And what I like to do, uh, it's it's perfect as is, but what we also have on the website are these great sandwich sauces from Tony Sachery's. I've got the sweet and spicy sauce today. For about the last five minutes of cooking, I'm gonna put some of this on top with either a pastry brush or a spoon, nice little layer, put it back in the oven, it's gonna give you this great little crust, uh, almost a sauce on the, on the fish. So we'll let this go five to 10 minutes and we'll be ready to eat. All right, now we've been in the oven uh, about 400 degrees for about eight to 10 minutes. I'm gonna go ahead and pull it out. Okay, and as we can see, we're starting to get a nice little color on there. And really all I wanna do, I've turned the oven on to, to a broil and I wanna take our sauce here. Again, we've got our sandwich sauce, the sweet and spicy from Tony Sasseries. We're just gonna kind of squirt a little bit on top. And then you can take a pastry brush or just a spoon like I've got here, real basic. Just kind of brush this evenly across the top of the fish. And we'll put it back in the oven with the broiler on for another three or four minutes. That's going to really give this a nice crust, a little more flavor, uh, and we'll be ready to eat. So right back in, broiler on high, three, four, five minutes, we'll be ready to eat. Now we've had it in the broiler on high for about two or three minutes. We're going to go ahead and pull it out. As you can see, we're bubbling. We've got some nice golden brown color on that sauce right on top. We're going to go ahead and take this off with a aluminum foil. All right, so having that skin and the scales on really helps to create a really a shell to he, help keep this all together. We'll put this on a service platter. I'll just put a couple of chives right on top for a little bit of color for you. Serve this with some green beans, some roasted potatoes, your favorite side dish, mac and cheese, and your, uh, your Sunday afternoon dinner is complete. Uh, again, CajunCrawfish.com, redfish on the half shell with a little bit of our Tony Sachery sandwich sauce. Great for the oven, great for the grill. Uh, our, our website straight to your door. Good to go.